What's up, y'all? Today's deck highlight is Double Ice Fishing Non Reno Shutterwalk Shaman. So, the idea behind this deck was I wanted to test out this double ice fishing draw engine with four, you know, Murlocs. Obviously, you have your Flurgirl Talks with some utility Murlocs like Finley and Mutanus uh, as ways to help just churn through the deck alongside the Primal Dungeoneer. Uh, the deck actually ended up pretty all right. Uh, I held about 50 50. Uh, up at around top 100 legend, which, uh, you know, for <laughs> an experiment is generally better than my decks normally go. Shadowwalk Shamans have quickly become my favorite decks in Wild right now, as they feel like one of the few ways that you can actually play a control, uh, grindy type of deck. If you guys don't want to run the Ice Fishing Package, uh, <laughs> I have another video coming out later this week. Um, as an example of that, but you can cut the, the Finley Wizard, one Ice Fishing, and Mutanus, and run stuff like Colt Neophytes or Broomsticks, uh, or some other tech options <laughs> to help round out your deck. So the game plan behind this deck is to get uh, an infinite Shutterwalk train rolling, but instead of doing kind of the OG Life Drinker style uh, package, uh, I've tended to favor the, the style of deck that makes a bunch of copies of Shutterwalk with stuff like Serenite Chain Gang, uh, play a Lothab effect, and then you get to bounce those copies of Shutterwalk with stuff like Barista or Zola. So you don't get a bunch of one mana Shutterwalks, <laughs> but you, you get these huge board of six sixes under loath of effects. And you get wave after wave after wave of them. And eventually your opponent will not be able to deal with the unending wave of six sixes. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed today's deck. And if you guys do, make sure you guys drop a like, comment, and subscribe. It's a small thing, but it does support the channel a ton. And of course, you can check out some live gameplay over at twitch.tv slash kitmeowth. Or find any of my other deck lists in my Discord. You can find links to those down below in the description. With all of that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. That is um, uh, some intense hopium. Can we uh, can we get some hopium in chat for that comment? Just uh, we'll just pull this up here. Looking forward to playing some standard. This looks great. I just have to be annoying and ask though if anyone has a time to look at Wild outside of the Druid bug deck. It feels like it's in a really bad place again. We've discussed watching changes, but opted to wait a bit longer. It's on our radar. Hopium. Looks like Martian's also playing the fun rogue deck. <laughs> JJJ meant what they said. Ooh, that's good. That means no Edwin. That's not good though. Yikes. Um. It's okay, we got this. We got Serenite Chain Gangs. Man, I really wanted to Macaw <laughs> this turn, but I think we're going to have to Earth Revenant. I guess I could just Macaw and then make a value trade. Hmm. What do you guys want to do? So next turn we can go like Dungeoneer Hero Power and then the turn after we go Double Macaw. I kind of want to save Finley here uh, because I have Flurgle Talks and then I can always just like drop another Finley afterwards. Potentially. Stone by stone, oh, you know what? How about how about we just draw a Glock Crawler? You guys down with that? I'm kind of down with that. Damn. It's not too late. We can still draw a Glock Crawler. 
Where's the cookie after all the speech about the 2x ice fishing? I mean, we are running 2x ice fishing. We're just running Finley instead of the cookie. We are running four Murlocs double ice fishing. Nature waits for no one but me. God, so many cards. Feels good, man. Five Murlocs equals five head. Is that how that works? <laughs> I would really like to draw Glock Crawlers, actually. Real talk. Our time is almost up. Backstab. You played both Plunders. Are we just making uh, a Gigante Edwin? Yeah, it's a, not an Edwin. Hey, there's a Galaka crawler at least. Nice. Um. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Damn, I was really hoping for a healing totem here. We've been nuts. Our hand looks very reactive with like nothing good to do. Care to make a wager, friend? Care to make a wager, friend? Double foxy scabs, I'm assuming. Have you seen Dane's latest build? You like the Life Drinker OTK aspect? I think Life Drinker forces you to play Grumble, and I don't really think Grumble's that good. I, for the longest time, I've actually just been a proponent of, like, Shutterwalk with Barista um, and Chain Gang. I just think that's better. Just that's my personal opinion, obviously. Um. Care to make a wager, friend? Makes sense versus hunters, you just chain life drinkers. Yeah. I mean, I think you are better off served just chaining like armor vendors and like Colt Neo fights than life drinkers, but. I mean, I can see it. I don't know. I, I will also say that I haven't really checked out Dane's build, so I'm kind of just talking generally about life drinkers in general, but. Did that Shroud only draw one card? <laughs> Wait a second, did that Shroud only draw one card? <laughs> oh no. So this is like a perfect time for us to Tannis, right? Yeah, perfect time to meet Tannis then. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> it's not meant to be. Yeah, then you double trade. So they're setting up for, uh, what do you call it? Smite lethal. GG's. So we just assume every mage is Ignite Mage, right? And all of these cards suck against Ignite Mage. Yeah, have a good night, Ramon, and have a good one. <laughs> I 
All right, we are looking for Lotheb and Makaz. Oh, they're playing the spell version of the deck. Hmm. Nature waits for no one but me. I guess we rat next turn. Rat and try to slow him down. I can even like double rat. Ooh. I can't play any of these other cards here. <laughs> so we will ice fishing. And then we'll go again with the macaw. Yeah, that right hit was good. Slows him down. Again, again. Again, again! Again, again! <laughs> we we did the thing. <laughs> nice sorcerer's apprentice, nerd. Got him. Still gonna lose? There's no way, dude. No, I'm sure there's a way. But there's no way, dude. There's no way. I want to bounce these first. Before Flame Ward. Alright, next time we go again? Uh, Otters, that was also before they got a bunch of tools like me to NS, right? GG's though, GG's. It's actually insane. Stance, constructed. I'd do double the Glock probably though. That's nice. Stance, constructed. Rogue have we played against today? I feel like it's 30-40%. Yep, we have played against 40% rogue. Not including this game. That's insane. There is so much rogue. <laughs> Wait, are we playing like aggro rogue? This looks like King's Bane. Uh, I'm gonna eat that because of Shadow Steps. King's Bane? Yeah, it looks like King's Bane or like Aggroog or something. Mm, I do not have deck commands because I've been hopping around decks, but I can grab you the code for this. Be, let it be known that this deck is 3 and 5, okay? Uh, this deck is not great. But it is new Shutterwalk Shaman, so. Oh, so this was bad ordering, by the way. Uh, I should have let it on the Armor Vendor, Glock Crawler second, in case I top deck Macaw. I actually need to get used to this whole, like, I have to pay attention to my Macaw ordering, right? It's actually super relevant. Hey, Martian, what's up, dude? Hey, 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 how's it going? Thank you so much for that raid. Hope you had a good stream. How's it going? Wait, what? 
Why did they bump there? Help! Why did they bump there, chat? Why did they Why did they bump to three? What are they playing? Blade Flurry. <laughs> Wait, do we play around Blade Flurry? I don't play around Blade Flurry. <laughs> don't play around any of that. Nope. Double ice fishing, but no cookie. We're running Finley. Finley Wizard for all those hunters. The deck's not bad, the streamer's bad? I mean, that's also true. <laughs> those are not false statements. This is not what we stood for. Break it, you it. Break it, you it. They're playing deckhands, plunders, patches, buff. They have to be playing Kingsbane. Kingsbane with a random Edwin. You know, more than I, I think Edwin's probably fine in Kingsbane, real talk. Kings Kingsbane's probably like okay running an Edwin without issue. Give me that. Not what I want. Ben. What are you doing, bud? <laughs> Edwin is a draw to an aggro. I think it makes sense. I think it makes sense. Stream was good. How are things here? Pretty, pretty good. Played a lot of the uh, the Edwin rogue. Um, had a lot of fun, and then we queued into a bunch of pillager rogues, and then had significantly less fun. <laughs> but playing some shaman. It's not going great, but I don't know. Shaman's fun. Shaman will never not be fun. Yeah, you know, it's one of those decks. What is even in my Shutterwalk pool? Two Armor Vendors, two Glocka Crawlers, and that's it. <laughs> and a Serenite. It's good enough for me. I don't know what that is, but let's find out. That's actually an insanely good hit for us, by the way. We take this. So playing the Shuttle Walk gives them eight armor, but it also gives me eight armor. <laughs> Jeez. There was a cool lethal Flurgle Wizard. Oh, there was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you just steal their dagger. You're right. I mean, I think I just keep the Murloc so that I guarantee get the Flurgle here. I have not yet, Marsh. And the moment I started playing this, I don't think I queued into any Odd Hunters. <laughs> not yet. I do. I do think that like the Finley is better than Cookie, though. Unfortunately, I think it's. I think it's good. Wow, your ice fishing only draws one card? Scrub. I I have this dead card though. Don't don't tell him. <laughs> what the Hello, old friend. Let's meet for tea after the match, shall we? 
nature waits for no one but me. Why is there an overconfident orc? Uh, because it is a three drop that they got off of their Serpent Shrine portal. And then we just play the Canal Slugger this time. Did they hot fix the bug? They have. Bug bug has been hot fixed. Yeah, yeah, I, I I'm not saying that double ice fishing is better than the the normal ice fishing. <laughs> I I just wanted to try it out. I brought up the idea on the podcast, and so I like actually wanted to try it out before I said anything about it being bad or good or anything. So here we are. Um. Here we are, unable to dump my hand, so this is a little bit awkward, but... I think I actually just play a two-mana do-nothing, and then dagger. Because <laughs> if I play this, I overdraw, right? And I don't have an armor vendor. Well, yeah, luckily for us, we got the uh, two-mana do-nothing. That actually helps us smile. Putting overconfident orc in the same set as Og Merchants was a really weird choice. I needed that. I mean, like, not super badly, but, like, I still needed that. Let's draw two. Um, I'm at nine, so I probably sit. This dagger's actually been super nice. <laughs> All right, so our goal this game then is to strip their hand with Mutanus. Like that's how we're gonna win. All right, we're. We're gonna toxing pretty early. God. That card's so gross. Like, it makes me think that it's like actually good. Like, <laughs> every time it's played against me, I'm just like, oh, that is so much value. <laughs> it's really slow. It's so slow, but if you can get away with it, it's pretty powerful. Devolve? I mean, the only thing is giving them a Flurgal Tox. I think I'm okay giving them a Flurgal Tox. If there was like a Reno or a Zep, I'd Devolve. I think I want to get this out of my hand. Get seven mana card out of my hand. If I hit one of the combo pieces too, all the better. That's fine. Alright, so this probably baits out the second Flurgle Talks. Nice Mutanus. Yeah. Yeah. Probably do this, yeah. The issue is, is like, I'm out of gas. Got nothing else. I need my barista, and then I need my shutter. Do I die here? There's no way, right? Ooh, that is really good. No taker? 
I don't know. If you're running Spirit Echo, is Note Taker even that bad? You have a Dungeoneer? I have no more spells left in my deck. So my Dungeoneer doesn't draw anything. It's a 3 mana 2 3. Note Taker good? Yeah. I can see it. Help. I drew so many cards and I still can't do anything. Feels bad, man. <laughs> God, you drew double storm, got double storm off of that. That's gross. That's so gross. <laughs> God, my ordering too. I should have played the freaking chain gang last. Nature waits. I keep not playing around my stinking macaw. <laughs> double the power, double the storm. Right, it looks like they're playing Higgs List. Higgs List runs two invokes with the Galacron, which is super weird, but... It has to be, right? Reno Galacron Shaman? That's gotta be Higgs List. Oh, wow. You went for the Coil instead of, like, Draxus or something. Oh. So I don't have a Lothab effect in here. They have played their rat, though. I think we can afford to wait, right, for the Barista? Hmm. We just hold this Galaka Crawler, right? I really, I really need this barista card, or I need the macaw. Yeah, we just hold this in case they have uh, shutter, shutter walk into rat. Could have honestly even held on to the earth revenant, but those trades were super clean. Alright, I have the Macaw now, so now we go in on the Shutterwalk. Yeet. Oh, found their found the Bolner, guys. You guys were wondering about the Bolner. Found it. <laughs> oh, they have no minions in hand. Alright, so. Ideally, we draw Barista. If we don't draw Barista, then we don't play any more minions for the rest of the game, and then just chain Macaws. Sound good? God, this seems so weak, dude. Why? I I really do not like the Reno Shutterwalk that run Galakrond. It just does not make any sense to me. I really wish I had a Lotheb in this. Would be hot. Wait. Why did I think that this would win me the game? I still needed my barista, no? You are too late. This return is not Wait. Wait, 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 wait. This whole not having um Maybe I need Zola. Alright, Breeze off the top. Let's go. Let's go. Boom. Oh baby. 
Never am I ever fucking punished in this children's card game. <laughs> Never am I ever punished in this children's card game. To be fair, I only had six cards left in my deck, but it's all right. So, I think I've asked this question before. If I Bolner Shard, does it double freeze the same enemy, or is it two? Like, is it a random enemy? So I could freeze two things. I'm pretty sure I've asked this question before. I just don't remember the answer. You'd assume random? You know what they say about assuming. Yes, yeah, so that's exactly what they say, just can see. <laughs> Alright, so they get an Atheron and stuff next turn. And I get to Hero Power. Smile. I think that's actually pretty bad for us. <laughs> Letting them hit that and get that in the raised Deadpool is pretty bad, I think. Sure. Is that food? I, need it. I think I'm okay with that. I am gonna devolve this board. Pretty sure. Uh, cause I don't want those in the raised Deadpool. I did draw a chain gang. Like I have something to do with my mana now, but I'm pretty sure I still devolve this board. What do you guys think? So next turn I can Lurker, I can go Lothab, I can do Bolner, Coin, Chain Gang. Got a bunch of different options here, I think. Hmm. I think I'm going to get Glock Crawler value. Yeah, that seems pretty good. <laughs> uh, that's actually hilarious. <laughs> Oh, okay, that that's actually really funny. <laughs> Calculated, yeah. <laughs> uh, that's a that's actually hilarious. <laughs> never punish. Wait, never punish for what? What do you mean? Devolving there, I think, is the play. Alright, how do you guys feel about Flurgle Toxing this board? The issue with I Flurgle Tox is that I don't do anything else. Is it ever worth Flurgle Toxing and then tempoing out the Bolner? Or should we hold the Bolner? I think we we'll probably hold the Bolner. So we do this, let's do this. Fortunately, I can't coin here. Drift and drift definitely caught. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Alright, they've had one, two, three, four, five. God, it's so likely they get back Lotha. No hit? Nope. Because Molten Giants exist. I'm not winning this game by hitting him in the face, right? We're not winning this game with minion damage. So I'm going to limit how easy they can get their Molten Giants out. Any Eddie Rogue? Yeah, if you want to check the VOD, we played like two hours of Edwin Rogue earlier today. All these playlists, man. I think they're good. I just don't think they're like great for stream. You know?
Hmm. What do you guys want to do? I kind of want to get this tail end down. I wonder. This is not what we stood for. You want to concede? Well, I don't want to. So that's all that matters. Hey, what's up, Paige? I'm assuming you were talking to me, right? <laughs> it has indeed been a while. Hope you've been uh, been alright. Obviously, I never. <laughs> So, if they're running Slingers, what are they not running? They're not running Defiles, right? If they're running Slingers. <laughs> Am I safe to play around Defile? Or not play around Defile, rather? Oh, damn it, dude. What was the last Battle Cry I played? Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. If I play Bolner Revenant, that's two. What to do? Four damage AoE. Wait, what was the last Battle Cry I played? Oh, no, my brain. Uh. Hey, Raffle, what's up, dude? Thank you so much for the huge host. Appreciate it. Welcome, 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 guys. Hope you guys are having a good one. Uh, I am... Toxman? little time. I don't know what this is worth, but... We'll see. You played Ashley Communion on turn one, so that means it was a good stream. Feels good. <laughs> Sound, sounds like it was a good stream, then. But, hey everybody, welcome from Marvel Stream. If you guys don't know me, my name's Meowth. We are playing Wild. We are... Uh... We normally play decks that are a little bit less meme than Rahul, but we uh, we do like to still play some bad decks. Uh, example number <laughs> one. <laughs> but I uh, hope you guys are having a good one. Make sure you guys hop on over here uh, if you guys want to chat. Alright, so we Primal first. I guess it didn't really matter. Assuming meme decks are bad? Me? Never. <laughs> Prime doesn't... Uh, if you refresh page, it'll give you a little notification. But also, hi, Susan. How you doing? I feel like we're in a pretty good spot here. Lothab's down. Three Giants are down. Think we're okay? Hey, what's up, Fish? I'm doing pretty well. How are you? How did we clear flesh? Um, we put a lurker below. There's more to you than me. Don't worry, guys. Dark Lair's tier one. <laughs> 